Hi there, Anastasia here from Soundscaping Source and Show Me Hope with your self-care minute of the day. Today's focus is joy and we will be planning something joyful to look forward to. So a couple of things you'll need is your calendar and maybe a list of things that bring you joy. So let's first start with what brings you joy? Well, for this purpose, we might want things that we can do that brings us joy. So maybe getting your favorite treat on the way home after work. Or maybe there's a movie or show that you've been wanting to watch but haven't gotten around to it. Or maybe there's even something bigger to celebrate, like a birthday or an accomplishment. And once you figure out what kind of thing you want to celebrate, go to your calendar, and pick a day where either you'll prioritize that celebration or maybe you'll fit that celebration in as a way to balance maybe a difficult thing on that day. Now the reason why we'd want to schedule in things to look forward to is that in our day-to-day -day we really get wrapped up in that forward momentum and sometimes that creates monotony and it gets harder and harder to complete those maintenance tasks and things that must be done when we don't have things to look forward to. So by strategically placing joyful events and things that really motivate us and make us feel excited and ready to face those harder things, we can boost our joy levels and really just have something to look forward to. Thanks for watching, happy planning, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.